Hi everybody, it's Wanda. So I'm gonna try to hurry this one. I'm expecting my son-in-law to show up to mow. And I have my phone on airplane mode so he can't text me and it come through. So this is gonna be a quick one. I've covered the surface with a white base coat that is Artist Loft mixed with Floetrol. One part paint, two parts Floetrol. This is, if you saw the video where I tried the hologram paint and, and there was a blue paint and the blue, the hologram didn't show up. The white, I mean the hologram paint dried clear and so I only ended up with blue and glitter. So that's what I'm pouring over. I have mixed these with um, just Liquitex pouring medium and some water and I just bombed a painting with them. So I'm going to do a quick little flip cup. I'm putting a little white in there. I'll show you my colors in just a minute. Try to get this done before Paul shows up. These colors may not do very well together. I'm not sure. We will see. So, put all the rest of that pink in there. Get rid of it. I think I have enough. Boop. There it goes, because my table's uneven. <laughs> okay, that's okay. That's okay if it wants to float around a little bit. Let it float some more. Had too much paint. Oh me. The first part that came out is really lovely. Let me pop a bubble or two. Uh-oh. Have a bare spot right in there, right there. So I'm gonna try to push this around a little bit. Get that covered. Okay, now, I don't know if you've seen the video, but I did one where, oops, where I sprayed silicone, splashed silicone on it after I stretched it, and it was all metallics. So... I'm really, I don't like all that blue, big open blue area there, even though it looks like ocean or something. Um, I'm kind of wanting to try that with this Liquitex and see what happens. Ooh, I like how that stretched up there in that corner. And see if I get cells. I have my spray bottle. This is um, Lifespan Treadmill Belt Silicone Lubricant, and it's 100% silicone. And this time I'm going to spray from up here instead of splashing it before I put it on my hands. Still way too much. Way too much. Lots and lots and lots of little bitty cells. Ah, this is so much fun, though. Holy moly. Let's see if y'all can see that. See all those little tiny cells? See if they'll stretch out a little bit.
Yes, it looks like lacing, but the, um, the purple right in here doesn't look so good now. But this did stretch out, and it looks cool. So I will take the camera down, give you a close-up, and then um, I'll give you my paints right now. I have Apple Barrel Blue Bonnet, Apple Barrel Tropic Orange, Apple Barrel Candy Pink, Craft Smart Apple Tart, and Apple Barrel Purple Iris. Those were mixed with just a little bit of, I'm thinking 10 to 15 percent maybe of Liquitex to paint at the very most, and then water to make them thin. So um, that's how I mixed it, and this is a 6x6 gallery wrap canvas. So I will take the camera down now and give you a close-up, let you see the cells. I think I was better off when I put it on my glove and just flicked it on there, but um, spraying it was fun, so I may try it again on a bigger canvas before I stretch it and see what happens. So thanks for watching. Okay, so this is how it looks. My boss just sent me a text. Hang on a second. Okay, so this is how it looks close up. And it really did sell up. Sh you know, squirting that stuff on there, spraying it on there. So, I think this is an awesome way to get cells. Now, when I stretched it, that those went wonky on me. So, it is a very thin silicone. It's not like the coconut milk stuff. So, I don't really think you could spray it and then stretch it very well. But, I may do a test on that, too. So, thanks for watching. I'll post a picture of this after it's dry. I wanted to show everybody what happened. This is the first time using Liquitex pouring medium that I've had cracks. And, if I remember right, it was Artist Loft white base coat that was underneath it so I don't know if the two of those don't go together so well but this was also the one that I sprayed with the lifespan thin treadmill silicone so that could have had an effect but this is just <laughs> it looks like alligator skin it's just unreal how badly it cracked so, more experimentation is needed.